This one is about how to make a nice oven roast chicken to do a chicken in the oven, full chicken. So first you wash your chicken, get your chicken nice, this is a nice big chicken. You get your chicken and wash your chicken nicely and drain it, clean it up properly. So you have your chicken ready, yeah, okay. Make sure your chicken is washed nice. I have tomato ketchup here. I have olive oil, browning, some barbecue sauce, a jerk. I have a piece of lemon right here. With my piece of lemon, I have green onion, I have thyme, I have onion, I have garlic. So I chop my onion over here. I have all purpose, all purpose season right here. Grinded ginger right there. Ginger powder. And I have some garlic powder. And I have some chicken seasoning over there also. And salt. So I have all of those. I chop my onion into a little bowl right here, chopping the onion, then green onion next, chop my green onion, okay, yeah. chopping my green onion, after chop my green onion, garlic, chopped up in pieces, yeah, chopped up, Thyme, some nice fresh thyme, okay. Mm -hmm. Leave this big chunk of thyme right here for now. A little lemon juice, take the seed from this piece of lemon. Yeah, a little lemon juice, okay. I think I saw a seed, yeah, get that seed out. Barbecue. Oh, there's nothing much leaving in the bottle. Can I get enough from it? Yeah. Yeah. One tablespoon barbecue. Okay. Then the browning. Half of teaspoon browning. Half of teaspoon. You don't want it to be too dark. Okay. Ketchup. Sorry, not ketchup. Olive oil. One big spoon. Tomato ketchup. About three tablespoons you're gonna need. Three of that spoon. Whoa. Yeah. Okay. You stir this in together. Okay. Stir this in properly. Okay, put this aside down there. Put this aside, rest this aside right there. Okay. So, get the chicken right here now. These ones, mixed all in. This is grinded pimento, grinded ginger, a little bit of cloves, garlic, all-purpose seasoning, and chicken seasoning. That's what is right here. And a tubes of salt for flavor. So I mix these in and then rub it over the chicken. Okay. Yeah. Turn it. Let me go on this side so you can see better if I turn my camera that way. Can you see better? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's way better. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then this one, rub it in, get some under the skin, get some on the inside. Kind of polish it all over it. Okay. Try and get it under the skin. 
to put the flavor inside of the meat. Wow. Yeah, this chicken gonna be yummy. Okay. Okay. So I polish it with that. Good. So it's looking beautiful. Up close. Nice way of chicken. Then this one now, I take this one. Get some of these on the inside of the meat for the flavor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Try to stuff it in as much as possible. This garlic and onion and stuff going through and through the meat. Okay, your home is heated to 350. Get some on the wings. Yeah. Your oven is heated to 350 and you put this in your oven on the 350. Then you can reduce the flame after. So I'll show you how to do it while I'm going down slowly, little by little. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna get this, wash my hand quickly and get this in the oven. Okay, yeah, my hands are washed, so look at it. Looking very nice, right? So I'm gonna get that in the oven now. Oven has been preheated. Yeah. Stick it in the oven. And give it a nice one and a half hours or one and one forty-five minutes. Take a look in the oven. Yeah. Chicken is yeah, yes, slowly cook it up, okay, okay, it's coming up, so let it roll, let's grab the chicken now, let's take a look, see what it's like, oh, yeah, okay, okay, That one, yeah, okay, how does it look, do you like what you see, so this juice now that is inside the, okay, that's my bowl where the sauce was in, mm-hmm, Okay, I pour, pour the top right here. Do a polish on. That's the bowl. I did mix up the little sauce in the blended stuff. And this is the jerk barbecue sauce. I just add a little bit of water in the bottle and rinse it out and add it to it. I had a fresh time. Stuff it inside. Yeah. Okay. So I soak it with this one 
and then put it back in the oven. Let it go back for another five minutes and then it's ready to go. So I just put the sauce in and the little extra seasoning and the ketchup. The ketchup is what I use to give it the color. So you want it to have that nice golden look. Soak it well. You can take a little brush and polish it on. Or you can just use your spoon. Put some on the inside. Let it flavor it. Yeah. Try to get it underneath the skin. Nice color. So after that you can get a fork. You can use a knife to do this or a fork. Whichever one. You can take a fork and you just punch. Punch it with a fork, you can use a knife, you can use a prick and just poke, prick the holes inside. You don't want your chicken to be too dry, like you're eating trash. Yeah, so you put this back in the oven. It's already cooked just to get this glaze on it. I put it back in for another five to 10 minutes. Back in the oven again. Just take a look and tell me what you think. Nice oven chicken. Okay. five minutes and then we see you can stuff your turkey with carrots with vegetable with potato whatever you want to use to if you can you if you want to use some stuffing so while it's in the oven cooking I'm gonna boil some potato and some carrot and dice it up and put it inside to heat with my chicken so this is what I'm gonna peel and wash and cut up so I can have it to serve with the chicken okay so, water in a little pot on the fire. Tubes of salt in the water for flavor. Then I'm gonna chop up, peel and wash, and chop them up, put in the water to boil. Let's take a look. Fire is off. Carrot and potato. Yeah. So you mash the carrot and the potato together. Yeah. So just chop it up, mash up everything together. Everything mash out nicely. Okay, so carrot is mashed, potato is mashed. Yeah, see, that's what it's supposed to look like. Okay, chop together. Now I'm gonna take the big man out of the oven. Let me make some space up here to put it. Okay. Open this off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
fire, 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 steam. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Perfect oven roast chicken. Take a look. All the herbs and spices. And now I make my little salad to serve it with. Okay. Have him in a nice little bowl. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And that's how your chicken supposed to look like. Now I'm ready to eat. Yeah. Nice oven roast chicken. And I like the color, golden brown. Fully soaked inside. And my mashed carrot and potato. A lot of people said they didn't know you could mash carrot. Yeah, just like you do your mashed potato. You can do the carrot and the potato together. And that give it that nice orange looking color. That's potato and carrot mixed together. And this is the chicken right here. So please like, share and subscribe. You can enjoy your chicken like that. A lot of people don't eat turkey. So you pot roast your chicken just like how you do your turkey. And have it for your Christmas, your holiday. Whatever way you want to have it. Please like, share and subscribe and see you in the next video. Okay? See you around. Now you have the base there. The gravy, the sauce. You can use this. Eat with your potato, your rice, your food. There's a lot of flavor inside of it. Whatever you want to eat it with. You can just pour it in a bowl and serve it as gravy sauce. So when you slice your chicken, you can even spring, put it back over it again. Okay. See you in the next video.